So let's just see how we can perform insertion in a B plus tree. So here we have the question insert into B plus tree of order 5 these following values. So here the order is 5 that means the maximum number of children that any node can have is 5. The minimum number of children that any node can have is 5 by 2 ceiling of that value which is 3. Now the maximum number of key that any node can have is order minus 1 which is 4. Now the minimum number of key that any node can have which will be this minimum child 3 minus 1 so it will be 2. Now we have exception in case of the root node. So in case of the root node the minimum number of child can be 2 and the minimum number of key that it can have is 1. So here we have the node. Now this node has maximum key capacity of 4 and the node can have maximum of 5 child. So these are the pointers to point to the child node. So first of all we have to insert 12. So 12 will be inserted in our node. So next we have 5. So because 5 is lesser than 12 so that means 5 will be inserted before 12 because we have to maintain the sorted order of the elements. Next we have 20. So because 20 is greater than 12 so it will be inserted right here. Next we have 8. So because 8 is greater than 5 less than 12 so it will be inserted in between them. So that means we have to shift 12 and 20 and then 8 will be inserted right here. Next we have 3. Because 3 is less than 5 so that means it will be inserted at the beginning of the node. So now you can see this node has 5 keys and here the maximum key capacity was 4. So that means now we have to split this node into two halves. So here the middle of the node is 8. So that means 8 will be our root node. Now on the left side of 8 we are going to have values that are strictly lesser than 8. And on the right side we are going to have values that are greater than or equal to this root value. So that means in this case if we split that into two parts. So on the left side we are going to have values that are lesser than 8. And on the right side we are going to have values that are greater than or equal to 8. So that means here also we are going to have 8, 12 and 20. So that means left pointer will be pointing to this node and right pointer will be pointing to this node. So now you can see here you can notice we have two duplicate values and the leaf nodes contain the actual values. So that means these are all the actual values and the internal node contain the key or the index. These are not actual values. So these are the keys that are used to navigate or find. So the internal nodes contain the key that are used to navigate or find the actual values that, that are stored in the leaf node. So that means all of these are actual values. So next we have 30. So because 30 is greater than 20 so it will be inserted right here. Next we have 15. So 15 is greater than 12 less than 20. So 15 will be inserted in between these two keys. Now you can see this node has more than the maximum capacity of the node. So now you can see this node has 5 keys. So that means we have to split that into two parts. Here 15 is the median. That means 15 will be lifted to our root node. And now we have to split that into two parts. On one side we are going to have values that are lesser than 15. And on the other side we are going to have values that are greater than or equal to 15. On the left side we are going to have values 8 and 12. And on the other side we are going to have the values 15. 20 and 30. So that means the left pointer will be pointing to this node and right pointer will be pointing to this node. So next we have 7. So because 7 is less than 8 greater than 5 so that means 7 will be inserted right here. Next we have 35. So 35 is greater than 30 so it will be inserted right here. Next we have 31. So because 31 is greater than 30 less than 35 
so that means it will be inserted in between these two keys so now this node has more than the maximum capacity of the node that means we have to split that into two parts here the median is 30 so that means 30 will be lifted to the root node and this node will be split it into two parts on one side we're gonna have values that are lesser than 30 and on the other side we're gonna have values that are greater than or equal to 30 so if we split that into two parts on one side we're gonna have 15 and 20 and on the other side we're gonna have 30 31 and 35 so that means here the left pointer of 30 will be pointing to this node and the right pointer of 30 will be pointing to this node so next we have 6 so because 6 is greater than 5 less than 7 so it will be inserted in between these two keys so that means 7 will be shifted and 6 will be inserted right here next we have 1 so because 1 is less than 3 so it will be inserted right here now this node has more than the maximum key capacity of the node here the median is 5 so that means 5 will be lifted to the root node so 5 will be inserted right here because 5 is lesser than all of them so that means all of them will be shifted to the right and 5 will be inserted at the beginning now here this node will be split into two parts on one side we're gonna have values that are lesser than 5 and on the other side we're gonna have values that are greater than or equal to 5 so if we split that into two parts so on one side we're gonna have 1 and 3 which are lesser than 5 and on the other side we're gonna have 5 6 and 7 so now the left pointer of 5 will be pointing to this child this right pointer of 5 will be pointing to this node now the right pointer of 8 will be pointing to this node this right pointer of 15 will be pointing to this node and this right pointer of 30 will be pointing to this node so next we have 55 so because 55 is greater than 35 so it will be inserted right here next we have 52 so because 52 is greater than 35 less than 55 so that means it will be inserted in between these two keys now this node has more than the max key capacity of the node so that means we have to split that into two parts so here the median is 35 so that means 35 will be lifted to the root node now here also we have more than four keys so that means here also we have to split that node here the median is 15 that means 15 will be lifted so 15 will go to the root node and here this node will be split into two parts now on the left side we're gonna have values 5 and 8 on the other side we're gonna have values 30 and 35 so this node is split into these two parts so here the left pointer of 15 will be pointing to this node and the right pointer of 15 will be pointing to this node now here your question can be if we are splitting this node then why 15 is not duplicated that is because all of these are internal nodes so they contain the key they do not contain any actual values because all of these are keys the keys that are used to lead to the actual values in the leaf node so we do not need any duplicate values right here so that's why on the left side we have values that are lesser than the root and on the right side we have values that are greater than this root now here also we have to split this into two parts so on the left side we're gonna have values that are lesser than 35 and on the other side we're gonna have values that are greater than or equal to 35 so that means if we split that into two parts so on the one side we're gonna have 30 and 31 and on the other side we're gonna have 35 then 52 and then 55 so now we have to adjust all the pointers so the left pointer of 5 will be pointing to this node the right pointer of 5 will be pointing to this node the right pointer of 8 will be pointing to this node now the left pointer of 30 will be pointing to this node now on the right pointer of 30 will be pointing to this node now the right pointer of 35 will be pointing to this node 
because here all the values are greater than or equal to 35. So this will be our final B plus tree after the insertion of all of these values. So here you can notice all of these insertions are always done at this leaf level. And then we split the node and we grow towards this root. And also here all of the leaf nodes are connected using pointers. So one after another all of these nodes are connected using the link. Now these links can be used to traverse sequentially. This way we can access all the values in sorted order. So hope you understand about the insertion in the B plus tree. Thank you.